Your Excellency, President of the Republic of Kenya, Honorable Dr. William Ruto, the Lady the Chief Justice, and the President of the Supreme Court, the Deputy Chief Justice, Judges of the Supreme Court, the no other judges, the Excellencies, the Ambassadors here present, Cabinet Secretaries, ladies and gentlemen, uh, good morning. Uh, Your Excellency, uh, when I look at the judiciary of today and compare it with the judiciary where, where I left 25 years ago, I can truly say that there has been uh, transformation and progress. Courtesy of uh, the 2010 Constitution, Your Excellency, we have clear provisions uh, on access to justice and as a consequence the development of the process of the National Council on Administration of Justice whose core function is to coordinate or to ensure coordination of efficient, effective, efficient and consultative justice system in the country. Indeed, Your Excellency, I need not uh, repeat the very critical role that is, being, that is being played by the recently launched Court Users Association as a result of the 2010 Constitution. Your Excellency, the judiciary that I served in 25 years ago was one where access to justice was left to everybody's maker. It is true that uh, adages like justice delayed is justice denied have always existed. But in the 2010 Constitution, there is a clear requirement for a robust justice system, both in the criminal and uh, the civil, civil justice sector. It's therefore gratifying to note the, that the National Council on the Administration of Justice has for the first time prepared a report on the activities that they have uh, undertaken in the, in the year 2021-2022 on the basis of which other actors in the justice sector will have an opportunity to hold the National Council of Just on Administration of Justice accountable, just as is required of all of us, Your Excellency. Therefore, it's uh, not, uh, not, not, not indeed uh, something that uh, is outlandish for the, the Chair and the members of the National Council on Administration of Justice to require or request, as uh, the DPP has said, that we in the Executive and particularly the Office of the Attorney General and State Law Office facilitates the enactment of the National Council on Administration of Justice Bill. I'm aware that uh, even though I just took office recently, the bill has progressed quite, uh, quite far and I would be re requesting the other players in the National Council on Administration of Justice to give us the latest ideas that there may be to uh, effectua effectuating the realization of uh, that bill. I'm sure, Your Excellency, Kenyans will recall that on accession to office, you did make a public pronouncement that this shall be a country that is governed on the basis of the rule of law and not the rule of man. Your presence here today, Your Excellency, is testament to your commitment to that uh, public pronouncement on your very first day. And therefore, uh, just to allay the fears expressed by the DPP, uh, your presence here is not in any way to dictate to the justice sector how to, to do their work, but to collaborate and support 
the sector in the various endeavors that they are involved in. And we did, Your Excellency, we commend the many strides that the, the judiciary has made. Just recently, when uh, the judiciary launched uh, the state of the judiciary and the Ministry of, of Justice, the soldier report, we did witness for ourselves the many strides, notwithstanding the complaint from the Supreme Court that they are working in a museum. But uh, Your Excellency's commitment is at once improving the work environment of everybody in the judiciary and indeed in the entire public, ser public service sector. In those few remarks, Your Excellency, allow me to congratulate the players and all the actors in the National Council on Administration of Justice and wish them uh, fruitful de de deliberations uh, as we launch this annual report. I thank you. Thank you so much, the Attorney General, and thank you so much for your candid words and encouragement words. Your Excellency, with your permission, I request now we focus on the screens for a brief video session. Welcome, sir.